Hello my beautiful cappuccinos and welcome to your annual reading. So today we're going to be seeing what is coming towards you family, lover, friend or foe. Please remember the energies in the readings can go vice versa. Okay, so switch the gender, switch the roles, do what you have to do and leave the rest. If any of you would like to book a personal, the information is in the description box below. I hope I didn't just repeat that. I'm sorry guys if I did. <laughs> it's really hot man. Okay, so let's just see cappuccinos. Let's see what's coming towards you. So for my beautiful Capricorns. Okay, what do we have? Oh, we have individuality that wanted to come out. And at the bottom of the deck, we have all eyes on you, beautiful. It says, it girl, congrats on the feature, babe. Okay, so for some of you, I feel like um, there's something that you do that's really unique. You're standing out. So somebody may shout you out or you may get featured like on an online magazine or... Um, I'm getting something about like an exhibition or something like that. Somebody wants to feature you on their website, on their page. They want to talk about you, your work, what you do. Okay. Or you're just getting a lot of in, um, invitations. Yep. You could be getting invitations, invited to places. But you're gaining a lot of... Um, I forgot the word I was going to use. A lot of people... Attention. That's it. Sorry, guys. <laughs> you're gaining a lot of attention for something that you're doing. Okay. So this is really, really beautiful energy. I feel like you're original, you're unique, or there's something that you have created that people haven't seen before, okay? Something is just real different, and you're being recognized for it, okay? So yeah, all eyes are on you. So beautiful energy. So I kind of just feel like you're feeling yourself right now, or you're going to be. So congratulations on whatever this is, okay? So you're going to be noticed. Someone notices you. You just stick out, Okay. Because, you know, it's raining, but she's just oozing, like, um, uniqueness. She doesn't look like she's bothered by the rain at all, okay? So I kind of feel like, you know, everyone's kind of like a dark grey cloud and you're like the rainbow or something like that. Okay, so let's just see. Oh, wow, beautiful energy. We have success that wanted to come out. It says, give yourself a round of applause. You made it. Enjoy the fruits of your labor. Yes! Gorgeous energy, cappuccino. So, yes... I'm telling you, you're going to be very, very successful, okay? This is what is coming towards you. Remember, these readings are timeless. So if you're asking about something in the future, something that you're working on, just know you will be successful. A lot of people are going to be giving you a lot of attention, okay? Some of you actually may become famous. It just depends on what it is that you're doing, okay? This could be something about a course, like, did I pass? Did I get a good grade? Yes. Underneath that, we have heritage. It says... Your ancestors are so proud of you for you are proud of yourself. Exactly. So I feel like you're proud of you. You're proud you're you're proud of the fact that you're unique. You embrace your 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 um individuality, your originality, your quirks. So your ancestors are saying like listen, you are proud of yourself and we love that. You know, it gives us great pride to know that you are proud of you. You're not trying to hide who you are. You're just embracing yourself. So, yeah, I'm just getting, like, a lot of pride here. Feel proud of yourself. The people before you, everybody around you is just, like, you know, I'm just getting, like, woo! <laughs> Honestly, so this is so gorgeous, okay? Maybe you promised, like, your grandparent or your great-grandmother or someone like that that you were going to do something and you, like, you know, you followed through, okay? Or you're, conti you're continuing some kind of tradition, okay? Oh, no, a fly just came into the house. No, no. Sorry guys, I just I've got the like the the blinds open so I can get lighting, but I hate when that happens because then the fucking yeah go out. There we go. Sorry, it went out. <laughs> I felt my energy like no, we're not even about to. I hate when the flies and the bees come in the house. It's really annoying and distracting. But anyway, it went out the window. Sorry guys. <laughs> okay, so this is for my beautiful cappuccinos. So yeah, be proud of yourself. So people are really proud of you. I'm Oh my goodness, we have oh so grateful. This is such a good reading, guys. We're getting good readings this week. And oh so mysterious. Yeah, I feel like you have no idea what's what's coming, okay? But you're going to be so grateful. I feel like you're receiving some kind of award or something or some recognition, okay? Especially if somebody featured you, I feel like you're so happy. You're just like, thank you. I can't believe you shared me or I can't believe you featured me. Like, I just, like, I feel like somebody's really proud of you and they want you to be seen. Because with the oh so mysterious, it's almost like people don't know about you. They don't know who you are. But I feel like, you know, your energy or whatever it is that you're producing is just something so different. It's something that, do you know what I mean? It's like, how's no one caught up to who this person is yet or, or this idea? So I feel like someone's really impressed by you and they just want to, you know what I mean? They want 
your your success to be shared with everybody else like somebody wants you to be successful so they're really going to help you and i feel like you're just like thank you you know what i mean like i'm just getting like tears of joy like i feel like crying like but like happy tears oh oh my goodness so yeah gonna have some kind of like tower because the cards kind of just all flew everywhere okay so it's something real unexpected beautiful energy yeah we have the workaholic exactly i feel like you're working hard and diligently on something you've been putting your ass you know you've just been putting energy into something so i feel like your hard work is going to pay off especially if you have lots of little things that you do okay but you know you your, your work is not going in vain somebody recognizes it or somebody who's already really successful wants to work with you because there's something that you do that they just feel like will be a great addition to their business or to their idea or whatever okay yeah we have the introvert that's what i'm getting with the introvert and also mysterious i feel like you're it's like you're just by yourself or you do things yourself or people just don't see you maybe you're just not really um i also feel like some of you are not really used to the attention do you know what i mean so it's kind of oh my god don't look at me you don't talk to me you don't say nothing ah. <laughs> you know like when you want success and you want everyone to notice you and then when you get it you're just like oh my god i don't know how to feel about this i don't like it okay because i feel like you're not doing something for the attention you're doing something because you just love it or because you're just very talented okay and it's almost like someone's like, how do you do all that by yourself? It's like, I don't even know. But I feel like you've been in the dark for too long. So it's just, you will be noticed at some point, okay? So yeah, this is gorgeous. Or like, maybe you're kind of like underground, like an underground artist or so someone that's underrated. You're just introverted. You're just literally, you're, there's only one of you or there's only like, um, what you do, no one else does it or they don't, don't do it the way that you do it. You're just to yourself like in that in the corner but it's like you you are this is almost like you know like in a classroom every other person's like um how can i say coursework is kind of similar to each other but like you're the one in the class that's at the back that doesn't mix with anyone doesn't talk to anyone nobody really knows what you do and then when you present your work to the class when the teacher does it's like wow this is like what i haven't seen before everyone's like oh my goodness like you slight underdog you like Oh my goodness. So yeah, it's like, you know, the quiet kid in the back is the one with all the brains or all the talents, but nobody would have ever known it because they keep themselves to themselves. I feel like you keep yourself to yourself, but it's because you're working on something. It's like, I don't talk to people. I don't mingle with people. I don't go out. I don't go parties. I don't go drinking. I don't do none of that because I'm so in love with my work. I'm so in love with my craft. Okay. So beautiful. Yeah. Underneath that, we have the businessman and then we have the lucky one. Yeah. So somebody's literally is about to change your life. Okay. Some business partnership or something. Beautiful energy, um, Capricorn. Okay, that was too many cards. Okay. Again, too many cards. I feel like a lot of people want you, a lot of people want your attention. Okay, what is going on? <laughs> Sorry, like the cards are going everywhere. Okay, so we have I am sassy and sexy that wanted to come out. And at the bottom of the deck, we have I am beautiful. So this could be as well, like maybe you're very beautiful, you're very sassy. Um, you're very confident in the start. If, even though you're quite introverted, I feel like there's something about you that's, um, you know, like I said, you're just unique. I feel like you have so many different qualities about you. You can't, you can't really be put into a box. Like people look at you, they judge you. And then, then I feel like you never cease to amaze. I'm hearing you never cease to amaze me. But I feel like this is why you're getting attention as well, because you're sexy. And you just say it how it is. You do it how it is. You know, it's like, I am who I am. You better like it or lump it, okay? Like it or loathe it. That's what I just heard. But I feel like they like it, okay? Also, for some of you, someone as well may feel like your what you do is very sexy or beautiful. And they they want to kind of like spice up their business, so if somebody, like, if this could be, for example, somebody wants to kind of, you, they want you to be an ambassador for something because they feel like you've got the right physique or you, you know how to draw a crowd. So I'm getting somebody here's already very successful, but it's kind of like working with you will bump up that success because you've got the charisma or the style, or the ethic, or do you, do you know what I mean? The work ethic. Okay, so let's just see where this is going. So far, so good my beautiful cappuccinos 
Oh, okay. The nine of passion. Oh, and the ten of passion. Okay. Double Sagittarius energy. Okay, so yeah, I feel like some of you, you've been working real hard. But you don't look like what you're, you know, you don't look um, stressed or you don't look like you're struggling. Because these are two cards of like struggling, being on the defense, but not necessarily. It, it could also mean that, you know, I'm hearing like I bend, but I don't break. Okay. Maybe you've had a lot of battles that you've had to fight, that you've had to face, but you just keep on going. But it's like, you know, the 10 of passion, this is like the full capacity of creativity. So I'm hearing like this shit is a breeze for me. So I feel like for some of you, you may like off not offend people, but I feel like people may feel a bit insecure around you. When people see you, they're just like, oh, I don't know. Again, for some of you, if you're getting a lot of attention, it's like it could be quite overwhelming. So when you first, you just like, like I said, you're doing something. It's just like, when am I ever going to get recognition? Like I'll be putting in mad work. And then when you finally get that recognition, recognition, it's like you're grateful. But it's like, oh, my God, this is like too much. <laughs> So I feel like that's what it may be. I feel like you may be just a bit overwhelmed. But it's a good thing, okay? It's a good problem to have, okay? But I feel like you work well under pressure as well. That's what somebody like, likes about you. Like you just do so many different things and you don't, like I said, you bend but you don't break, okay? There could be some people that are a, a, a bit, some people may feel some type of way when you become very successful, when you're recognized for something that you're doing. This could be like in a workplace, you get promoted and you've just started and all the people that have been working there for 10 years, like, okay, who's this new bitch and how did she just take over? Because it's like, bitch, I'm the boss. Like, I'm I'm just more skilled than you guys are. I mean, I don't know what to tell you. You know, because sometimes when you go into workplaces, everybody's very complacent. They don't like change. I feel like you bring change. Somebody wants something fresh. They want something vibrant. They want something exotic. They want some some oomph some pizzazz some ooh la la i feel like you bring the ooh la la <laughs> yeah underneath that we have the two of emotions yeah yeah people are shook man they're nervous people love you they love what you do but again i don't i don't even feel like you realize how amazing you are man you just don't know it you just don't see it you just don't know but be proud of yourself okay honestly so um Let's just clarify. I'm just like, what deck do I want to use? Let's clarify the nine of passion. Okay, two cards wanted to come out. We'll take this one, the page of wands, yeah. So you're going to get good news when it comes to something. So the nine of wands goes to the page. So that's what I'm hearing. I'm hearing like you're going to have to drop all those ones. Like you don't have to do all of this on your own. Because like I said, I feel like you've been doing something on your own for a long time. Maybe you've been working on something for 10 months. Okay, or you've had something for 10 months or for several years. And it's just like, yeah, okay. I've gone from the nine to the 10 and now I'm back to the one, okay? So I just feel like you're gonna get, you're gonna receive some really good news or some really happy news about something and you're just not expecting it, okay? So just be prepared to be overwhelmed with success, okay? Honestly, yeah, we have the lovers at the bottom of the deck. Gorgeous, could be dealing with a Gemini, does not have to be, okay? So that's what I'm hearing. We love you or we choose you. So beautiful energy, um, cappuccinos. So additional message. What does Miss Know all have to say? You are healthy. Okay. And then we have um, do what makes you happy. Yeah, I've been getting this energy. This is really beautiful. So yeah, that's what I'm saying. I feel like you do something because it makes you happy. And I feel like as well, this is why somebody wants to work with you. Because not that typical cappuccino energy. Like, cappuccinos can be quite ruthless, you know. It's all about the money. It's all about the Benjamins. I feel like you're not trying to do something for the money, for the attention. You just genuinely love something. You're just genuinely doing what makes you happy. Okay? You have a healthy state of mind. You're not corrupted. So that's why someone wants to work with you. Because they know that, you know, you're not going to get swayed by the attention, by the money, by the... You know, you're just, you're just truly grateful. I feel like you're just truly grateful. And there's not many people that are grateful these days you know now if you're worried about your health you are fine like i said maybe for some of you you've been dealing with something for like 10 months or more okay it could be something to do with your hair or your skin is what i'm getting but you're healthy okay i'm getting like a clean bill of health so maybe you're going to get some good news that you've been kind of worried about or apprehensive about and that's why you're so grateful yourself so, oh, thank god 
I just feel like there's something that you have on you that's like unique. You just don't know what it is, but it's you're not it's not a disease or anything. It's just a skin condition that you may have. So you're getting some good news like you're healthy, you're fine. It will clear up soon. You know, it's it's fine. Okay? So that's just like a side note. But either way, you know, I feel like with the you're healthy as well, like you're just a pure honest person. This is why somebody wants to work with you or they want to invest in you. You know, maybe someone just had to like figure you out first or I don't know, okay? But this is really, really gorgeous energy, Cappuccino. So, um, I hope you enjoyed your reading. If you did, let me know in the comments, like and share and subscribe to the channel. Bye! <laughs>